Hello, buddy. It's another episode of Let's Play. Well, let's Zelda Oracle of Ages. Last time we beat through, went through Jabu, Jabu, Jabu Jabu's belly. Wow, I'm speaking faster than my I'm I'm speaking faster than my mouth tongue can keep up. Wow, <laughs> and defeated the well a boss that was meh. In this episode, let's continue forward and try and find the last shrine which is missing. You have done so much for us. Our seas are clean and all is well. I offer you our symbol of heroism, the Zora Scale. We got the Zora Scale! Huh, that's interesting. I wonder what we'll use that for. Anyways... So... We're gonna exit Zora Village. Yeah. Let's get some more of these. Why not? We need more anyway. Exit Zora Village and keep heading right. We'd head back to the hut that we, uh, started in. Oops. Alright. Head up. Head east. There's the house again. And play the song to head back to time. Alright, oops. Alright, there we are. Dive down and you'll see an underwater cave! We never entered before. Because now that we have the long shot, we can actually get the chest. So. Oh, yeah. Do -do -do -do. And we just swim the other way. And we get ourselves a ring! This ring is random, I think. Anyways, resurface. Alright. Uh, do we need you in the past, or what? Uh, okay. Swim around the Sea of Storms. It's telling us to do it. I don't, I don't know what that means. Anyways. So. Oh, I see. Keep swimming around this area. And eventually, that's not the right area. Okay, then. We are looking for a pirate ship, apparently. According to the game. I see this, the Sea of Storms. There's a pirate ship! Hmm. Dive. Head around. So, we are trying to find that pirate ship. Alright. Problem is behind this uh, giant wall of water. Can't enter into it! So, how do we get in? Head south, and there's a wall blocking. Huh. Oh, Zora! The seas of beyond here swell up all who venture into them. The Sea of Storms. I cannot allow a child like you to pass. The Zora Scale! So you're the Link! You may pass. I know not what lies beyond, and I ask not why you must pass. Fare you well. And he's just gonna leave, la leaving other people to suffer the same fate in the Sea of Storms. There we are. Now we can enter the Sea of Storms. Anyways, before we enter the pirate ship, let's enter that cave that we saw. Over here. Which has... A magical ring! We'll get it appraised later. Later, later, later. Alright. Surface again, let's go find the pirate ship. Sailing across the seven seas, I don't know any sea shanties. If I did, I'd probably start singing along, but I don't know any. Hey! Anyways, welcome to the pi the ghost ship. If ye go to the ruins out east, ye can never return! Oh, let's go to shield. Why not? These are breaking our pots! Tales tell of giant ruins out east in the sea on no return. I should play a pirate game one day. There aren't any good pirate games, are there? Captain Neeson thinking about a thing! How long have we been adrift? Sail in the sea is every man's dream. It was so great to do so gallantly sail off to me dreams. But we got stuck in the sea, old oh, storms, and can't get out! Har, we've got the sore scale, sea charm. Aye, that could charm the so sea, old oh, storms. How about you give me that sore scale? Thank ye. You're, you're a good man. 
Ahoy, mateys! We're off to Oldrum! Dolodrum, the land of seasons! Aye, aye! Aye, aye, sir. Thank ye. Now we can escape these seas. Take this as a sign of home me, thanks. It is the jewel called the Toke Eyeball. It is said to be the thing that opens the way to the ancient tomb. I don't know if it is true or not, though. Oh, hey, we actually know where that, where that dungeon is. We've seen it before. <coughs> Anyways. <coughs> Coughing. Treasure of the Deep. And the pirates sail off. He really help, helped us out. Aye, we found that Toki Eyeball on Crescent Island. Maybe you should go in that way. We're off now. Ahoy, mateys! Aye, aye, sir. Aye, aye, sir. Anyways. Hmm, maybe we will be doing this one uh, thing, because we have a lot of time left, and we're almost in. We've already got the entrance to the dungeon down pat. But first, let's head to, uh, well, to the to, uh, south shore, because on here we have some rings to appraise. Well, might as well get appraise them right away. You know, as always. Frickin'. Okay. Head north and into the ring shop. That tower sure is bigger, and this hound is all around muck! My body's not feeling right, neither! I guess bad things do come in spades! I guess the town freak is weird. Do come in! Welcome to Voss's Jewelers! What can I do? Appraise all these rings! Hmm, I call this the Green Holy Ring! No damage for electricity! Alright. Hmm, I call this the Whimsical Ring! We already have that, so I'll buy it. Yay! Hmm, I call this the Like Like Ring! We already have a Like Like Ring! Well, 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 it's a new ring. And this one is the Red Holy Ring! No damage for small rocks! Huh. And this one is... The Pegasus Ring! Lengthen Pegasus Seed Effect! Ooh! Pretty good! Huh. Pretty good. Pretty good uh, amount of rings. Oops. Didn't mean to play that. Anyways, we need to head to Crescent Island now. Also, let's check on, uh... Blossom and... Let's check on them. Because there's new stuff. My baby never sleeps! How can I get him to sleep, Link? Sing with him. That's one thing that my dad always did. When I used to want to come to sleep. I like to sing. I'll try it. Well, isn't he a darling baby? My boy is well, so I can rest. Today I have more to teach. I've heard that a nut's contents, contents depending on the actions of the planter. The more he travels, and the more he beasts he slays, the better his nut will do. <clears throat> Alright. Give me a heart, give me a heart, give me a heart. I'm doing some lawn clippings. Or, uh, Link's Lawn Service. Anyways, head back to, uh, Crescent Island. Alright, head down. For you. Play ye song of... of sages. Head back over here, and... Well, we already know the location of the to of the, uh, of the dungeon. It's right there. Yeah. Place the last eye in, and, well, let's enter in. Heck, we might actually do this in one, in one attempt, just depending on how long it takes. And welcome to... Show your courage, wisdom, and power. The road to the past shall then open. Wait, but are we in the past? Are we going further in the past? This is actually a genuine question, I don't remember. Okay, there's courage. Or power, I guess. Alright. So. Alright, I guess this is... Uh, Alright, bombs, 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 bombs. Alright. So, bombs, 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 ow. Alright, in here. So. Basically, head towards the rocks. Basically, like this. Nope, frick. Alright. 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 Head up here, head... God clearly has me walking around. Okay. Jump to the right so you're one space above the green, the green, the green block. Okay. Alright. What? Alright. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, I see. So. So. Jump here. Let's see if we can test the northern wall. Head right three squares to reflect the... There. There we are. And now is an underwater cave part, which we can just head across like that. Jump, jump. Slide, slide. Alright, head up. And surface. And there's some armor statues. Well, push one of the armor statues to fit with the rest of them, and the way opens to the next area. This is, well, one of the most. Ha well, I've tried. But yeah, this is one of the most dangerous areas in the game, having Lionels and Dark Nuts of all plenty. Dinos and Dark Nuts of plenty. I really should play a pirate game. Maybe I should do some Sea of, sea of Thieves streaming. Even, uh, I mean, you guys, if uh, any, if you guys, you guys be interested in that, uh, post in the comments. Seriously. I got loved. And I show you my pirate's voice. Nay, but my Sea of Shanties of plenty. And a and a treasure load full of booty. Anyways, uh, <laughs> that's another day though. Today is Zelda Day. Anyways, ow, freaking Lionel. All right, step, step. Wow, oh, yeah. decapitation. Hmm, bunch of statues of uh, what appears to be Queen Amby, or yeah, what well, appears to be Queen Amby. Anyway, just head around. Oh god, blue lionels! Those are horrifying. Stay strong. Alright, stab, stab. Yeah, we have enough time for for the dungeon. We'll just have to do it in one huge uh, thing. Okay, I see the way forward. Alright. Two, three. Those be one giant episode. I hope you guys don't mind an hour-long episode again. They usually try to keep it below an hour now, before before I used to do it a lot, and probably save the longer episodes for like the live stream days. Head inside to the final dungeon, the Ancient Tomb. The longest and biggest dungeon in the game. So. So, break these pots and get yourself some supplies. You'll need them. Again, this dungeon is the longest in the entire game, and Jabba Jabba's belly was already pushing it for length. So, head up. Light the torches. And defeat the guineas. Some swords, some little sword swipes will do. Guineas thankfully have like half the HP they had. In Zelda in, Zel in a Link's Awakening. Alright, and there's the guineas defeated. Up here, push this up, and... You hear that? Yeah. Also, there's a bomb wall here. It's bomb and run away. Because in here is our next room. Bomb with some wall masters or floor masters, shall I say? Did they spawn limitedly? No. Or yeah, maybe. I don't know. Bomb that. Get ourselves a small key. All right. Continue forward. I guess not, they just spawn in threes. Okay, I was hoping to get some bombs, but okay then. Have it your way. No. Alright. Be right back, but cat's meowing. Alright, I'm back. Cat was meowing outside. See, she's back inside now. Alright, in here. Long hook time. So, yeah, we're going to be using basically all of our items. If you're wondering whether there's some item slots missing, we will need to... Do, that's that's uh, post-game stuff, so... Yeah. Hmm. I see. And we need an Ember Seed for this one. Or a Seed Shooter. We literally are using every item we can. It's a lit thing. And then we can use our uh, Canis and Aria. Place that there, and step on the last switch. Two. Open a pathway forward. The basement of the dungeon. 
Yeah, we haven't found the map yet. We've already explored a huge area. Anyways, in here, head up. And we have this thing again. Flip it up. Flip it up. Some guineas. Beat them. Just use your sword. Just smack them to death. Q. 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 Alright. After that, push this block left. We'll have your little staircase down. Now do we head down it? No, we just head up. Because up here... is a chest containing a small key! We need to, uh, to hit a switch. I'm guessing it is down here. So, down here... is the dungeon map. Now you can see how big this dungeon is. BOOM! This dungeon is massive, with, th with four floors and a ton of rooms. We'll be here for a while, so j so buckle up. So, now that we have that key, head back from once we can. Head back from once again. Because now we can open that door that we that, that door that was locked for. Alright, and we'll enter another one of these rooms. Yeah. Okay, that was a lot. Alright. Okay, one spin attack does deals with the guinea pretty well. Got it. Even though I probably think she called pose, but at this point, little guineas work too. Head up here and right, and hit the switch. Doop. Turn it red. All right. Uh, where do we go? From here. Head right and down one screen. Head left and walk past these. To get the compass! I mean, see how many chests are here! Again, there are a lot. We'll, I'll be trying to get most of them, but again, depending on how long it takes, you know. Wait, did I just... Wait, did I deposit my rings? Aw, oh, the brother emblem. We are still missing some things in here. We're missing some keys. But anyways, you got that. Now we need to hit the thing again. Yeah. It's good that we have the sword beam, so I can just go... No. Oh. There we are. Alright. Head forward. Alright, from here, we head... This way. Some dark nuts. And more statues of a, uh... Queen Ambie, or is that Emperor Gestahl? Actually, thinking about it. Because it does look like Emperor Gestahl, doesn't it? The the pillar here. Anyways, bomb. Because... Yeah. And head down. Anyways, blade traps. You know the drill? Peg a seat up and run for it! Ow! Alright. Could have worked, but I... Took, I ate it. Ooh, it's two fairies. Neat. Neat. We'll need to head- we'll need to use these again, so let's just do uh, that. And here's a small key! The one on the list! Alright. <laughs> head up here. Alright. Now we need to head all the way back from once we came. Yeah. That's all we came here for, for that part. And then we just switch to red again. Yeah, so there's a lot of backtracking in this dungeon. What? What the heck? I'll tell you what. <laughs> I need to watch Game Bell. <laughs> I need to watch a lot of TV shows, but... Uh, I've, never, I've never been really a live TV guy. More into, uh, movies or, uh, anime or just watching, uh, or just playing video games. Watching YouTube. Anyways, have here. Head around here. And some Stalfo. We know how to deal with these guys. Smack them, and we get a key. Apparently, it was helping one of them, Zelda 1 style. Okay. Head down, and then we can head it. Well, that way again. So, circle around again. And we need to head to the right. Just circle around. All of the area. Now head down. And over in this room. 
head right. Or, actually, we need to circle around again. Yeah, do a full circle, I'm not even kidding. Same thing we did last time. Oh, okay, never mind, it did fix itself, thank god. Alright, I was, I was wrong. Thank, thank god I was wrong, actually, genuinely. Ow, freak. Again, thank the lord I have that light ring. It helps. Head right again. In here, defeat all the ropes. And avoid the beam eye. Ow, freaking. In here, a door opens somewhere, or I guess something happened, I don't know what happened. Alright, oh yeah, it opened the way over there. But anyways, in here, a bunch of mini mold worms. I'm pretty sure, just defeat them first before we reset the room, so... So, yeah. Oops, well, there. So. <clears throat> this way? Curve around. Curve around. Curve around here. Head down. Curve around this way. Alright. All right. All right. All right. I think I can tell. I can tell what the rest of it is. All right. There we are. And with the entire room filled, we get ourselves the power glove. We can now play NES games really crappily. I'm joking. But anyways, we can all lift heavy objects and throw those gestalt, those uh, giant pillars of what appears to be Queen Ambi. Or, uh, Emperor Crystal, I guess, because why would Queen Anne be on the Yummy Spinners? Head back up, and open the door up here with that key. Yeah. Now we can throw these giant pillars. Alright, was is, is that into the right area? Uh, just checking. Pretty sure I opened the wrong door. Oops. Okay, no, I didn't, thank God. What appears to be, like, a. What is the shape of that? What appears to be a giant, really misshapen snake, like fat snake. Anyways, what we need to do is uh, head down, defeat the dark nuts, or get hit by the dark nuts, I guess. Hit the switch, lower the thing, and hit it again. And now we can climb across the top of these, this uh, fat snake of uh, of red bricks. You jump across, and head down here. And in this area, we have... Well... We're back, well, in this huge roundabout area. To you, because why not? We can head down this area that we now have open. And in this room, follow the path to be the Gibdos if you want. Pium, 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 pium. And head in here. A bunch of, uh... Of, uh... Sparks and a huge amount of stuff, which, which, well, yeah, which will lead to the battle against Blue Stalfo, who is apparent, who is a dark wizard apparently in this game, and is apparently copying Agaden. Oh, for apparently Agaden is in this game again. It's Agaden's ghost, but Agaden's also Ganon, so I mean it does make sense, but not really. Anyways, defeat the thing. Just get it. That's how you defeat. Uh, let's. Hey, I have an idea. Sorbian does nothing against this guy. Charge ring. That'll do wonders against this guy. Oh, frick. By the way. I'm pretty sure this is the mini boss of the dungeon, but I'm also pretty sure there's multiple mini bosses. But anyways, first, well, Blue Stuff was defeated. Or uh, but yeah, which is a pretty cool, honestly, in addition to the Stuff though, being a wizard in this game. Anyways, head down and defeat the wizard ropes. <sighs> okay, yeah, I know the drill. Smack the wizard ropes with your sword. With your instant charge killing sword. All right, and re-equip your uh, light ring. Series of light rings actually coming in much handier than I thought I'd be. Okay. Re equip. Equip the power glove. Equip the power glove and head this way. I didn't need the power glove. 
More waste robes. I, I <laughs> grab my foot doing that. <laughs> Alright. More blue, uh. More blue dark nuts. Honestly, this game is very impressive, honestly. Alright. Equipped yourself with the, uh. The dual hook. Long hook. Get over here. And let's pick up this large statue for why not. <laughs> Yeah, oh, we got the Zoles. There, defeat them all. Head around, head around. Oh, we're back here. Use the dual hook again to head across this area. Another bug. It's lightning bug on the wall. Oh, that's cool. Anyways, head down here. Smash, smash. Smash, 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 smash. And in this room... Who... Ow, my, my spine. Anyways. <laughs> uh... Oh, a chest. Ah, huh, neat. Hoi! And here's the key. Hooray! Oh, continue on, continue right. And in this room. I don't know why I decided to repeat a bunch of, uh, of things, but in his here we get ourselves the slate! Ancient words are written on it. They won't tell us what those ancient words are, because, well, uh, we don't speak ancient, uh, Librinian. So, head down. Hey. We cleared out a ton of stuff. Holy crap. Anyways. Alright, jump over the head ledge and head right, down, left, down. Right. <laughs> one repeat. Down. Left. Down. Alright, and here. In here, we have a big room with four slate slots. That's, well, we can't do anything with that, so... I mean, we can insert one of them. And that's it. Okay, to be all of you. And pick up one of them with the power glove. And reveal a staircase down. Alright. So. Do that. Reveal that. Level. Flip. And get ourselves the boss key! The boss key already? Huh. Neat. Alright. So, boss key is gone. Head around that. Hmm, more dungeon to do, because we still have a lot of dungeon left. Remember. Alright, so, we know what to do with this, so... Bloop, 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 bloop! And hop across, because we have the rocks now, they might as well use it. Now. So, hop on it. And a big area full of, of attacking blocks, so use your shield. Just speed up for it, you guys. Anyways, there. Head down. Bunch of blade traps again. Whoop! More, uh, spinner traps. Blade traps are these things. Oh! Crossing! They, they're crossing the beams! Click on this. And, and it will cut away a giant part of the wall. Now head forward. In, into an ice area against a ball and chain trooper. Ow, we're getting smacked. I probably should have get, got myself a healing potion, shouldn't I? Anyways, I mean, I have no really use for the money. But anyways, up here is another slate tablet. Head back on here. Ow. Alright, another one of these. Open this for our gosh, see which we're to get. Alright. Head this way. And head upper room. Just found a bunch of candle heads sleeping. Yes, that is her name, Candle Heads. Fire, 
Fire. Oh, you can shoot them twice in order to light their candles up more. Ow, frickin'. Okay, I'm about to get- I'm about to die. Also, uh, rocks, feather, basically ignores ice music, so use that to your advantage. Alright, that's open. Open this up. Head in this room. Please, why don't you have a fairy? I'm just gonna say that. Please. Dying. I'm kinda dying here. That's mom. That is the opposite of a fairy. <laughs> that is a- that is a, uh, that is an explosive device. That can very much take my life. Alright, down here. Swim! And up! And we're in an underwater area now. Oh, thank you, Fart, actually. Oop. The game recommended using the long hook, but I decided to just hit him with the sword because I live dangerously, that's why. No, it's because I wanted to. See. I was lazy. <laughs> I was too lazy to swap. Alright. Big water puzzle. Don't careen into the water this time, me. Alright. Basically, avoid the pitfalls, and, uh, yeah, you should be hunky- uh, well, it's okay! Alright. Alright. And across. And in here. At the other side. No! Head the stairs. Alright. Head down through this room. Head up. In this room, we'll find the third tablet. Ancient words are written on it. Ancient hollow journey, then. Draw me in. Which way do we go? Alright, back underwater, I guess. This time, head up through the left side, instead of the side we came in. Over here. You should end up up here, step on the switch, reveal a stair dick case down, which will be permanent. Good. I kind of want to play Castlevania, but I also want to hear to the... I also have a couple other Let's Plays that I have. Up and running, but anyways, from here. Oh wait, so head left, then down. But yeah, we are almost done with this dungeon. We just have one last section. Of... We'll head up there anyway. We need to get it anyways because we're missing a ring. I think. Probably need to head up there. Please let us head up there because it's gonna annoy me for the rest of the game. If we're not, if that, if we can't get that to chest, I will pause the episode and head and head up there. I, I, I am telling you, I will get that chest. It, it bothers me that we don't have it. I went the wrong way, didn't I? Yep, I did. Was head left and down, not that way. All right, in here, let's place the other, well, the other tablets. So, and skadoosh. Probably can't get the tablet yet, so that's why. Head through the left side of here, and some ropes. Stab, stab. Ooh, thank you. And you. Stab. And a bunch of lava. I wonder how to do this. Anyways, we need to, we need to use, before we do that, use a key, head in this room. There's some pots. Thank you for the pot. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Alright. We're the way for, but that's not the way we're supposed to go. We're supposed to go down here. Equip your Pegasus seeds. And your power gloves. If anything, this should be nothing for Link, honestly. Uh, let me throw, let me throw, let me throw! Uh. Alright, and then. Boop. Aha! And we had to. We had made it through. So. What's our reward for doing that? I went the wrong way. <laughs> no, I was being a, I was being an idiot and forgot to actually grab the thing I was about to grab. But anyways, just for all right. 
No, I actually am not at the wrong area. That is the way to get forward. Anyways, that's how you get the chest. Anyways, in this room... Pull that up. That's how you get the chest that I missed. Alright. Okay. Equip yourself with the, with the seed satchel, and run for it! And down here is the last of the items of the tablets. Ancient words are written on it. Head across. Jump. Head up and use the correct thing. The swappy swap. Long hook. Head up. Alright, push this block out of the way. And get ourselves the, the chest we miss. Hooray, we're not missing a chest! So now we just need to go all the way back to that hut, to that room. In here, by the way, is a gacha seed. Not much to, not much to say. Not much to do, not much to see, so I just grab the gacha seed. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> the joke was so, was bad. <laughs> the joke was not funny. And I know it was funny. Makes it worse. Alright. Hmm. I see. I see. Head across here, head up here, and head down here. Head there. So we're basically we're heading all the way back to that room that we were, that we were in. The tablet room. So. No need to do this again. Ah. Went the wrong way. Because there's a room attached to this, I think. No, there isn't. No, there very much isn't. Okay. Not the wrong area. Where did I go wrong? Okay. Very much went the wrong area. Okay. In this room? Hmm. Oh, I missed something. I was supposed to press a certain switch up there that I forgot to press. Anyways, <laughs> press that switch in. Do -do 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 -do. All right. Now hit that one, right? Oh no. Uh, what? All right. I see... Quote unquote. Let's see if I'm heading the right way. No. No. Oh wait, no, yes I am. Because you head down here. Oh no, you head forward through this room. Right? No. That's the wrong way. Okay, me. Okay, you're, you're connecting the dots, me. Ye the red blocks down. For now. For now, you need the. Yeah, you the blue blocks up, the red blocks down, right? Yes. Now you the red block. No, I'm ge I'm lost. Give me a moment. All right, I'm going complete not in circles. What the frick am I doing? You don't need to hit this. So, I'm just completely in circ- I'm going in circles. So, let's head back the way we came. Oh my god, I can't believe I just did that. So, we need to head through the right side of the, of the thing. I'm being an idiot, so I'm missing entirely the point of this. So, head this way. Can you up, then right, then down? Anyways, <laughs> all right. I'm no longer lost. There, haha, <laughs> got it. All right, jump across. Weep. 
We're actually almost all this dungeon, if you want to believe. So... We have all the chests, except for one, but... Which is in the final floor. No, I'm not even that. We are, we are done. But we just need... We have the tablets. We're just gonna open that up and then finish it. <clears throat> and then we just have the final boss in the dun... Well, the final dungeon, I should say, in the final cleanup. Which is some rings, but that's it. I'm pretty sure. A ring. Even then. I could've just warped here. Anyways, I could've just gone to the dungeon entrance and warped here. <laughs> I could've just done that! Alright. So, do that, head down, and insert the final tablet. Final tablet inserted. We open the way forward. And then we just remove one of the priceless artifacts that lists the history of Holodrum. Or, not Holodrum, but, uh, Labrinia. By the way, don't ask why Link is in Labrinia. There is no description inside of, uh, the manual. Just the Triforce transported to here. It, honestly, Labrinia could be an alternate dimension. Um, along with, uh, Holodrum. But I think they are different kingdoms. But anyways... Anyways, down here, we now can enter this room and finish this puzzle. Okay, bomb it. Boop, 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 boop. Alright, light this torch. Hmm, I wonder if there's listening to different things we need to use to beat the boss. Alright. So, bombs. So, bombs. The big gauntlets and a, uh, and the sea chair. And this, my, and this is Ramrock, the final main dungeon boss, which, as I listed, has the exact same thing we need to do. We need to basically hit him with his own fist first. And I'm failing, so I'm not close enough. Or I should be farther down. And hitting him like, that's the wrong way. There we are. Hmm, <laughs> need more ahead of him instead of following him. Boop! Like that. Okay. Seeds here, seeds here. Need to be closer. Put him in his, him in his face. There we are. Now that's down. Second phase. Are you putting the crusher? Now we need bombs. Like I said. Nope. Oh. When he starts crushing his his things, we throw a bomb into his grasp. Okay. Okay, he's in the wrong space, but okay. Maybe in front of him. There we are. Eat that. No, that don't work. Okay. Go over here, please, for us. For me. This way. Thank you. No, 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 no. Right. No, what? Hey. <laughs> Alright, did they drop bombs? Yes, they do. Thank you. Do, 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 do. I definitely... Wait, I definitely will buy a magic potion before we fight the final boss, though. I am gonna say that. Final boss is pretty tricky. Anyways. Okay, one more hit, I think, and then you should be dead. Good thing they give us unlimited ammo. <laughs> yep, there it is. And now it's seed shooter time. <laughs> yeah, they give sent seeds for this. So, boop. We just need to shoot behind him. Doot, doot. Okay. There. I try using the uh, thing. Alright. There it is. That's me more like that. Okay. Well, ow, ow. Okay, that's just hit me anyway. Alright. Alright. That is eye lasers! Alright. Alright, there's the sat face down. Now it's chucking time. Pick up his hut fists and chuck him at him. So he launches them out. 
Or just pick them up, I guess. Okay, do I have to hit him? The first, or what? I don't know what to do, how to stun this fist. Or I have to pick him up the front. Okay, nope, that is a... That is my fit. That is my... Oh, my HP gone. Alright. Okay, what do I have to do in order to pick it up? Oh, I just have to go up to him, I think. Not when he fires, I'm gonna just pick up the other one. There we go, I pick up the other fist. Okay, I see. Let's pick up the other fist. Alright. Drag, drop. Dra drag. Drop. Okay, never mind. Get punched. Okay. Alright. Boop. Second, third phase really hurt me a lot. Holy crap. Took like all my hearts. Anyways. Okay, I, I missed my chance at that one. Alright. What the frick? Grab it! Okay. Alright. Ow. Screw you! <laughs> Die! Anyways, <laughs> that's Ram that's Ramrock down. And we get our final essence of season. And also a full HP bar. Hooray! So this is The Falling Star, an essence of time. The eternal light of this heavenly body acts as a guide to the other essences. <laughs> Thank you, Link! You've gathered all the essences of time! Now I can create something that will aid you, Link. Please visit me after you've grown up. I'll wait for you, no matter how long. So, next time on Let's Play Legend of Zelda a Link, uh, Oracle of Ages, we're going to head into the end game. And, well, get, well, something very good. <laughs> so, yeah, we're actually going to head into the end game. There is not much for us to do other than that. Let's literally just head into the final boss dungeon. That's it. See you guys then. Have a great day. Bye.